Hi everybody, this is Irma from Food for Healthy Bones. I'm here with Skelly and this is part of my I Hate to Cook series. Now at this point in the series you may not believe that I don't like to cook but it's really true. I would much rather eat. So I understand where you're coming from with like, oh I don't want to do this but this is hopefully a wonderful sauce that will turn you into, I don't know, a kitchen queen. This recipe comes from Laura Parisi. She's my dear friend and her website is rootedangel.com. She's a food shaman. She created this recipe and with permission I'm so happy to bring it to you. So what we've done is that we dry roasted the pepitas or pumpkin seeds and they're like a tawny kind of fragrance and uh, color to them. They smell really, really yummy. I'm going to put that into our blender. I happen to have a Vitamix which I love but any blender will, will do. And next we're going to be doing rice, brown rice vinegar. Brown rice vinegar, we're doing two tablespoons of brown rice vinegar. And other times you can use this brown rice vinegar as a salad dressing with olive oil just to change things up a little bit. Then we're doing two, excuse me, one tablespoon of umabashi plum vinegar. Never heard of this before, right? Probably not. But this is a wonderful, wonderful vinegar that comes from the umabashi plum uh, that's been mar not marinated by, uh, I don't actually know the terminology I'm looking for, but it's a very medicinal product, this umabashi plum. Again, you could use this with olive oil to make a salad dressing. We're going to use one tablespoon of that. So we have our brown rice vinegar, we have our umabashi plum vinegar. Umabashi plum vinegar is good just right over some steamed vegetables. And we're going to add our flaxseed. Now if you don't take flaxseed oil because you are a breast cancer survivor, you can use olive oil. But flaxseed oil has its own benefits and we'll talk about that in a little bit. And then we're going to be using the gluten-free tamari, organic tamari. That's one teaspoon. And I really have to be careful because sometimes I think teaspoons are tablespoons so you know. Anyway, one teaspoon and a cup of water. This is filtered water and then we're going to blend it. The ingredients have been all mixed up in the Vitamix and now I'm going to just dress this steamed kale and give it a taste. This is a very different consistency. It's nice and thick versus just a salad dressing. Mm. Yeah. So the toastiness of the seeds, the pumpkin seeds really comes through and the umabashi plum vinegar just brings it up a notch. So yummy. So good for you. I wish you could taste the skelly but actually skelly is tasting it right now. So that's it. Food for healthy bones. Thank you for stopping by and wait, wait. Oh skelly wants to remind me that if you'd like to have more recipes like this please go to my website www.foodforhealthybones.com that's www.foodforhealthybones.com and there you'll see my five bone loving recipes put your name in there and you'll be on my email list and you'll receive monthly blogs from me all about food for healthy bones. Thank you for stopping by. Bye for now.